Hello guys, my name is Jesper Nissen, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a free profile link on beacons.ai. And I found this website, beacons.ai, by searching for Linktree Alternative, and then I got these guys here. And I took some of them and put them into my uh, link building sheet that I talked about in the previous video. They all seem to have a free plan. So let me just click on beacons, and let's open it up. So you click on pricing here. And you can see that they have a free plan and that it allows for unlimited links. So it's all we need, unlimited links. So I click sign up and I search for my username, which would be Jespernissen SEO. Next, my name, Jespernissen, my email address, jespernissen.com. So I am not a robot, create accounts. Let's see what happens, signing me in and I'll save. So add my socials. So let's uh, take uh, YouTube first. I think it's just business view. I think that's just what it is. Twitter, it's also just business view. And Instagram, I do not have. Next, customizing my experience. Hello, Jesper is SEO. Hmm. It actually seems that I entered the correct YouTube handle because now it's showing my profile picture from, I don't know if that's YouTube or where that's, if it's from Twitter, but uh, yeah, let's see. Oh, continue. You get a link in bio, blah, blah, blah. Let's click pause here. Now it's finished showing the video, so I click pause, continue. And continue. Use this. Yes, no problem. We're getting your page ready. Let's see what happens. Customizing background. Uh, right, yes, business, yo. Adding socials. YouTube. Subscribe to yes, business, yo. Hmm. That's actually pretty cool. So, what it's doing is it's going out to my YouTube and my Twitter, and then it's uh, scraping certain information and uh, doing everything for me. So I'll click done. And as you can see, I'm not doing anything at all. Your link in bio is ready. You can add more links, customize the sign, do much more later. Next. Oh, I clicked next two times. I didn't catch what it said on the button, but uh, your media kit is ready. Next. Uh, upgrade, no skip for now. Choose your free custom domain. And uh, skip for now because okay so the reason that you don't want a custom domain is if you do purchase a custom domain yes for example then you start out with domain authority one page authority one that's what you not that's what you don't want the reason that we built these profile links in the first place is that they come with a certain amount of page authority in the in the beginning because they're created as a subdomain or as a folder on this very powerful domain. So you do not want to do this. You just click skip for now. Welcome to vegans. Let's see what it says. Let's get started by exploring. All right, so this is the first time that I see this. Verify your email address to publish your profile. All right, let me just click pause and hop over to my email. All right, so I'm back. And I uh, verified the um, Beacons account by clicking on link in my email. And this is what it looks like back here because we can now investigate. This is domain authority 85. And for this URL, it's 37. So that's a very nice and very powerful link. So let's say 85 here and 37. And this is the uh, this is the uh, URL. Yeah, I'll format it later so it looks like the other links. Um, and the date today is 19 March 2024. So let's see if we can add, uh, can we add some links here? Add block, link, add link, HTTPS. 
nespressen.com at dut. Let's see what it says. All right. So layout settings title optional. Hmm. Yes, but Nesten SEO website. Uh, hmm. What does this look like? Okay, so what I can see over here in the uh, in the preview is that the title that I give it, Yes, but Nesten SEO website, is shown here, and the link itself is. You, you, I cannot define the anchor text because you can see that I entered the URL and then it created this small widget, which is actually, it, actually, it, it looks cool. It's, it, this is actually one of the best profile builders that I've seen so far. Um, but it does not appear to allow um, anchor text things. So I'll have to go with no. Unless I discover anything else, store once once suggested action. No, I don't want to store. No. Delete. Email sign up. One suggested action. No. Okay, so this is not the email form from my website. I thought it was the email form. So no, I don't want that because I don't want to use uh, Beacon's email system. So what I have now I, is I have the header, I have uh, the YouTube link, I have the YouTube video, and then I have the, the link to my own website. I think uh, I'll just um, stop here. So let me just refresh. And uh, so let's check if it's do follow or no follow. Uh, so what I do is I right click and I click inspect. And I click on this button here, and then I click here. And uh, let's see if I can find something here. Here, let's open it up. So, so this is the part where, where you have to look in the code because otherwise it will be a little bit difficult for you to determine if it is do follow and uh, or no follow. So I cannot see any rel is equal to no follow. The uh, so you're watching this, and uh, if you can see a do or no, or if you can see a no follow tag here, then uh, please feel free to comment. But I cannot see a no follow tag, so it appears that this is actually, in fact, a do follow link. Let's go down to my uh, website. Let's click here on this and let's click on uh, this here. Um, so yespanism.com, <clears throat> that's the link. And no, no sign of any red is equal to no follow. So yeah, for now, uh, we can, uh, for now, this is a do follow link. So let's say yes, let's make it green. Dude. And let's make it red in uh, this column. So this is actually, uh, so far, this is good. It's, going, it's looking good because I now have a ratio of 50% do follow and 50% no follow. So uh, that was it for this video, guys. This was the video about beacons.ai. And I will return with more videos about uh, how to create these profile links. I think it's funny. I hope you think it too. Take care, guys.